If you're planning to launch a WordPress site, you're probably wondering which hosting platform to choose and the hosting actually makes a big difference, right? You want something that's fast, something that's affordable, something that's easy to use, a lot of different things to consider when choosing where to host your WordPress website. And I've used WordPress for well over 10 years now and I've hosted a lot of websites in a lot of different hosting platforms. But in this video, I wanted to show you my favorite hosting platform right now to host a WordPress website. The platform I'm gonna show you is called Hostinger and I just actually moved my main website that's built on WordPress from a different hosting platform. I've had it on that platform since 2017, but Hostinger made it really easy to actually migrate existing WordPress websites too. But I'm gonna show you how to create and manage a new WordPress website right here on Hostinger in this video so I could show you step-by-step step how to do it. And I've covered Hostinger a bunch of different times on this channel because they got a ton of different useful options I use for my business. In this video, I partner with them specifically because this is my preferred way to host a WordPress website. Okay, let me walk you through step-by-step step on how to do this on Hostinger for managing your WordPress website. And they got a lot of different useful things, so you don't really need to be technical. For example, it has a one-click installation of WordPress, automatic updates, so you don't have to update WordPress all the time. The control panel is extremely user-friendly, all kinds of different things I'll show you here once we set up. Okay, I'll go ahead and put a link in the description to this page right here. And this is the plan I have, and the way the hosting works here in Hostinger, you could have with this plan, for example, 50 different websites. So some other platforms you have to basically pay for hosting per individual website, but this is a hosting plan where you could have 50 different websites under the same plan. And here, manage hosting for WordPress. This is the part that I'm gonna walk you through here. So a lot of different things, including basic e-commerce, one-click installed, really great for speed and things like that. They got a lot of different AI options too. I'll show you some of those. So you could kind of go through this. You could see all this is included here with this business plan here. And right in this box, by the way, they also gave me an additional coupon code here, Halfinity. If you apply this, you're going to get an additional discount. So by default, it applies a discount, but on top of that, you get an additional 10% here, and then you could continue to your checkout. This is based on 48 months, but if you want something shorter, you could always choose 24 months or 12 months here. Obviously, the longer, the better. If you're going to run your business here, you'll get a better deal that way. And then go ahead and create yourself an account, and then I'll take you to the dashboard here next. Okay, this is your hosting your dashboard here. We're gonna set up our WordPress website. If you go to the website list here, you'll see all the different websites. As I mentioned, you could have 50 with the business plan. So I have a bunch of different websites here. Some are client stuff, so I'm blurring some of them out here. But if I go ahead and add a new website from here, I could choose this option right here, which I'm gonna show you, the WordPress website. They also have a website builder, AI-powered website builder, really easy to use, but that is a little bit different. I covered that in different videos. I'm gonna choose this one for WordPress. And then you wanna set up your admin email and admin password. That's how you're gonna log into your WordPress dashboard. Okay, here you have two options for building your website. They have really nicely designed website themes and templates here that you could choose from or you could just type in a text prompt and have AI build your website. I really like this. And then you customize the way you want to. And then here you would type in a domain name if you don't have one already, it's gonna give you some options. So Mr. Tech Tutorial here is available.com. I'm gonna choose that one. And with that business account, you do get a free domain name here. So this is in my existing account, but for you, for the first year, it will be free. Now here in about a minute or so, it's gonna completely install WordPress for you. You don't have to be technical. It's a one click install. I'm gonna let this finish up here. So right here, your brand name is gonna go over here. And then right here, website type, if you have a business or if you're doing a blog, these are the different options you have. I'm gonna choose the blog option. And then right here, you would describe your website. This is a website full of tech tutorials for small business owners. And again, this is gonna be fully customizable. So I'm gonna go ahead and create it over here. So in about a minute, it created this whole website. So I'll just kind of go through it here. This whole area is gonna be customizable. I'm gonna show you that. Here's your tech blog section. This is a blog website and it's created multiple pages for us. So tutorials, for example, has its own page here and these are the things I could go ahead and edit. So it looks really nice. We got a blog page that it auto created for us too. So I'm gonna press confirm and edit here on the bottom. And now we're inside of WordPress. So I'm gonna show you some of the editing options you have available here. So if you click anywhere, you could change anything you want. So super power your business with us, right? So you could type in anything really easy to change anything that the AI wrote for you here. As far as the buttons go, any button that you click on, you could go ahead and change where it goes. So this is where 
the link to a different page. Maybe you could create a contact us page. With any images, if you click an image here, you have some options, but the replace option lets you upload your own images. So a lot of times when you're making a website, you probably have images on your own that you could go ahead and use. And if I wanna look at all my pages here, I could go back to this navigation tab here. I could see my main menu navigation here, so I could change any of the navigations on top. I could go to individual pages here, and this is gonna show me all the different pages. So we have four different pages, but I could always add a page from here, or I could go directly to any of these pages to make a change. So I'm gonna press edit here. It's gonna now bring me to the tutorial page, again, based on the original prompt I gave the AI. It created these pages based on how it understands what my website is about. So this is that page. And again, any of this is fully editable. So if I wanted to delete a section or change a section or even change the layout of a section. So let's say we want this kind of view instead of that grid view, right? A real quick change here. A lot of different things you could do with this section of the website too. Okay, now if you're used to WordPress, let me show you some of these options and I'm gonna talk about some of the benefits that you get here while hosting here too. But if you click this W icon right over here, this takes you to the traditional WordPress layout that you may be used to if you've used WordPress before. So with WordPress, everything is organized into pages and into posts. So if I go to pages, we have those four pages, right? And the hosting your dashboard, you notice it's a little bit easier than this WordPress layout, but you can't navigate through the WordPress layout. And if you do have some kind of a blog, these are where you create your new posts, right? Everything in WordPress pretty much has been this way for well over 10 years, right? But if I click hosting your on top, this brings me into a really nice layout. So it has this really nice onboarding here. They have different tutorials on their YouTube channel in the hosting your academy. So it walks you through a lot of that. So if I wanna edit my website here, it brings us here where hosting it makes it really easy to edit any of the section that we see here. We just drag and drop, right? It doesn't have to be through the WordPress traditional editor if you install WordPress a different way. Now with this, you also get this Hostinger tools and AI content creator option. This AI content creator, for example, is really easy to use it. So it says content type, I wanna create a post or a page. In this case, I'm gonna create a blog post. You could choose your tone here. Let's choose a friendly option and then choose the length. I'm gonna do a short one. And then what is your content about? So benefits of using WordPress for my business website here. You could also give it focus keywords for your content and create your content literally in one click. This comes with that plan that I showed you here in the beginning of the video. So it makes it a lot easier than jumping between different AI tools. You could do it right here all inside of your WordPress. Now you created the keyword, the meta description, AI generated images, here's your full blog post. You could edit it here as a draft or you could publish it if you like it here. And it's been added here to my website and I could edit this post anytime I want. Now I'm gonna go back to the hosting your dashboard. I wanna point out a few other benefits you get with that. Now here, when you're deciding to figure out where to host a website, WordPress or otherwise, your speed, your website speed makes a big difference, right? So right here, this shows you this page speed insight. You want this to be really fast. Fast load time makes a big difference with Google nowadays, right? The second thing is you want a user-friendly interface, which I showed you, right? You want an easy drag and drop. And WordPress, if you're not used to it, could be a little bit difficult to figure out. You need some plugins, but again, Hostinger made that part really easy for us. Then we wanna make sure our website is secure and safe, right? We don't want malware, things like that. So if you click over here, this has a malware scanner built in. So that is very useful. You don't wanna really worry about these type of issues. And the pricing I mentioned, that's another thing to pay attention to. You typically want something that's affordable. And if you have more than one website, you want something that doesn't charge you per website, right? Hostinger, 50 website under this plan. I probably have 12 or 13 different websites going on right now. And this is one of my favorite options with the WordPress managed hosting. So if I go over here on this website, you'll see under overview, the light speed is set up already by default. And you have some other things that are set up by default you don't have to worry about, but WordPress updates. So WordPress is basically comprised of a lot of different plugins that make WordPress run the way it does. So you want this option right here, smart auto update. This one, Hostinger will manage updates of WordPress core themes and plugins. Now, this is one of the things that was very manual with WordPress. I always had to make sure all my plugins are updated. WordPress rolls out new versions all the time, right? The themes get updated all the time. And this takes care of all that for you. 
So this is one of my favorite options. One of the reasons why I do like Hostinger over all the other providers when it comes to hosting is this right here. And then if you scroll down any install plugins, you'll see all your install plugins. You could turn them off directly from the Hostinger dashboard instead of doing it inside of WordPress. It makes it really easy to make sure what the security status are over here. You could even delete them directly from here. And if there's any issues, they have an AI troubleshooter. So this is part of that WordPress managed hosting. You'll be able to troubleshoot anything that comes up here on this page. And one of the other benefits is this is an all-in-one solution, right? So you have your hosting, you have your WordPress managed hosting. You also could get your email here, right? Your domain from here, your security analytics performance, all that could be controlled right here on the left side. So again, I'll put a link to Hosting Air in the description for you to try it out for yourself. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you on the next video.